so like real quick. Okay, let me turn my fucking dishwasher off. <clears throat> real quick, real, real, real quick. Hypergamy this, hypergamy that. It's real, undeniable. There's science there, so it's a real thing. But I think a lot of guys don't really know what it means or don't really understand it completely or at least have some misconceptions that I've kind of seen by talking to some guys. So guys will kind of be under the assumption that a woman will fucking just dip on your bitch ass for, you know, a motherfucker with more money, guys bigger than you, a guy who's better than you. But they don't really know what better means. So better doesn't mean, like, just more dollars. Like, or better doesn't mean he has more cars. You know, first of all, if I'm, if I'm doing this, it's because my contact's dry. Better doesn't mean, like, material things. It's never material things in terms of better. Like, if the man is better, you're fucking screwed regardless. Why would she stay, right? But if the woman's, if you find a woman that's better, why would you stay? It's kind of the same. So, when guys have a lot of money and they don't come from, like, a super rich family, that means that they made those dollars themselves, which is extremely impressive. And in doing that, you find out about the game and you find out about how the world works and how your life works and you fucking made something for yourself. And that is attractive generally. On the surface, it looks like money good because of that line of reasoning. Does that make sense? So, but a lot of guys will think, oh, a bitch is just going to leave me because he has more money. It's like, no. She's probably going to leave you if he has more money and he's a better man than you. And like him being, him having a lot of cash sometimes is indicative of him, you know, being a higher status male in general in terms of his, in terms of his masculinity as a whole, because that's kind of how it works sometimes. So for example, me, like I'm fucking pretty big and I look this way because I built this body myself. I sculpted this. I didn't really get any help. I mean, besides YouTube and the internet and things like that, um, I've, I've put things together, and I make my, I eat my own shit, I take my own supplements, I go to the gym alone, I did this, and that's attractive to women, because they understand that I have discipline, and it's kind of the same thing with all of those, like, minute, singular things, like money, uh, influence, the body, the amount of cars you have, the, like, these things that guys, but it, the guys don't understand, it's not the actual things, it's the principle, it's what that thing makes you, or what you have to be to get those things. Not what those things make you. That's completely wrong, actually. I fucked up saying that. It's what you have to be to achieve these things. You have to be a certain thing to achieve these things. And that is attractive. Not this. This is. Are you tracking? All right. It's kind of all I had to say, pretty much. That was pretty short.